Hey guys, welcome to the guide. So in this episode, we are talking about where to go to avoid World War III. Uh, because I'm think, well, I've been thinking about leaving the country for a while. But now I, I kind of just want to leave the country, anyways. So where to go to avoid World War III? Um, let me think. Well, definitely don't go to Europe. Definitely don't go to Europe. Uh, Russia? Nope, don't go there. Uh, Africa? Africa? Well, there's that whole pan and like Africanism thing going on where like they want all white people out so Africa is not a good place to go because I'm not in a mood to get kidnapped and like it's not like my parents are gonna pay for the ransom anyways so and that's a 50-50 shot if you pay the ransom because like they might let you go or they might kill you but if they like you they might just let you sneak off so I might be able to pull that off but because I'm white doubtful so yeah I'm not in the mood to get kidnapped so Africa's off um there's the Pacific Islanders. I like Pacific Islander chicks. They're pretty hot. Like they're like the right kind of spiciness. But then you got the whole like whenever the U.S. and China have their Pacific War thing going on, and like then you'll get stuck in the middle of the crossfires. So yeah, the Pacific Islanders are kind of off the table. So where the fuck to go? Um. There was that one Japanese chick. That was like a rare fish right there. She was the one I had that weird relationship with. Yeah, Japanese chick, you know who you are. If you're watching this, I made up a fake Facebook... I made up a fake Facebook profile, and I found your ass. So get on your Facebook, because I know you don't use it anymore. And, like, friend request me. Because I already sent you a friend request. Yeah, you. You. You know who you are. Yeah, that's, that's gonna work. That's exactly how that's gonna work. Yeah. Hey, she's rolling her eyes now. Yeah, you, you, I, I fucking found you on Facebook, I made up a face, fake, fake Facebook. So go log on to your Facebook that you haven't touched for like years, and like friend request me so we can get that going. Yeah, that's gonna work, that's not gonna work. Ah, well, at least she's rolling her eyes now. Anyways, well if that doesn't work, I don't know, I guess I could go to Japan. It's like... She was actual Japanese, and like Japanese, actual Japanese chicks are pretty hot. Yeah, but she wasn't like Americanized Japanese. She was like Japanese Japanese that came over to America. So she wasn't like what? Second generation Japanese? She was like Japanese Japanese. Kind of like the original Iron Chef, whenever it was like taking place in Japan and it was awesome. And then like we Americanized it and like the American version sucked. Yeah, she was like the original Iron Chef. Awesome. Yeah. Anyways, if you hear this, go fucking on your stupid Facebook and friend request me. It's a stupid name. You know who I am. You're going to know as soon as you see it. So, yeah, go do that. That's not going to work. <laughs> anyways, so where are we going to go? And I can't go to Japan anyways, because like, that's the first place that China is going to invade. Is like They're going to go invade Japan and revenge for the rape of Manchuria. So it'd be like the root, like rape of Tokyo or something. So I can't go to Japan, at least for not very long. But yeah, if that doesn't work, I guess I could go over there, spend a year in Japan, find a Japanese chick. So I need to learn Japanese. So I guess I should start watching anime and subtitles. And then where to? Where where to avoid World War Three? Where's a good place to avoid it? And there's South America. I mean, South America was not going to get involved in World War III. They're, they're, they are not fully far enough developed to do that. So, yeah, I could do South America, but, like, where at South America? I mean, if I go to Mexico, that's not happening. I'm too white for Mexico. And then there's, like, the whole cartel thing going on in Mexico still. Um, Colombia. Colombian chicks are hot, but, like, they're all plastic surgery hot. And plus, that's like the stronghold of the cartel, so that's probably the last place I should go. They're like, oh, it's a white guy. He must work for the United States government. Oh, 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 that's fuck him. Uh, no, no, uh, not Colombia. I guess I could go to Argentina, hang out with the old Nazis, like, that fucking ran away from Germany after World War II. I, I could be, like, a fucking one of those guys, I guess. I don't really want to be one of those guys, but I could be, I guess. I mean, I'm, like, blondish, hairish, and blue-eyed. So, I guess I could fit right in, but I ain't gonna do no Hell Hitlers. So, yeah, no, not Argentina. Um, there's Ecuador. I met a girl from Ecuador. She was pretty hot. She was nice, too. She was, she, she was like the right kind of spicy, also. I don't know if she was nice. I like her. Except for I was busy 
chasing that Asian girl at the time, so that didn't go as far as it should have. Oh, um, yeah, let me think. So, Ecuador. Yeah, Ecuador. Ecuador sounds pretty good, actually. And they have, like, that giant museum, that because they found remains of, like, some civilization that looks like it was built by giants. It, it's, it's obviously not supported by mainstream science, but, like, they have a fucking full-blown giant museum down there. That would be interesting to see. And, like, I could get into Ecuador pretty easily, because I have a record now, so... Like, I mean, New Zealand's not gonna take me, because, like, New Zealand wants you to be perfect. Canada's not gonna take me, because Canada's the same way. Uh, yeah! I think Ecuador. Ecuador. That's where I'm gonna go. Fucking Ecuador. I'm gonna stop for a year in Japan. And like get some stupid work visa. If they'll let me in. Hang out. Get a Japanese chick. Be all like, oh, I am samurai badass guy. And she'll be like, oh my god. And then I gotta talk her into fucking moving to Ecuador with me. Yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> yep, that's the plan. So yeah, I'll hang out with the, in Ecuador with my Japanese chick. And then I'll pull a linen. I'll just sit here and make stupid videos every day. And then just keep posting them online and just bug the shit out of the United States government. And yeah, I'll pull the fucking linen. And then, like, once the revolution and everything starts falling apart, which, you know, we got like 10 years on it, then I'll come back all triumphant and, like, pretending like I know what the fuck I did was doing all the time. And I'll be like, yes, I know how to fix this. Except for I won't, like, make the Soviet Union. I'll, I'll make. I don't know what the fuck I'll make. I'll figure that out 10 years from now, okay? <laughs> oh, it's so fucking stupid. Alright, thanks for watching. <laughs>